So I'm interested in the distribution patterns of several species of starfish around the New Zealand coasts. The ones I'm particularly interested in are, are starfish which have an interesting mode of reproduction in that they can divide in half and grow the missing arms. And the advantage of dividing like this is that it provides a, a quite rapid way of reproducing. So a population can increase in numbers quite quickly. If the individuals are dividing maybe a couple of times a year, you can imagine that the population numbers will increase quite rapidly. Uh, whereas sexual reproduction is a much more haphazard form of reproduction. Sometimes there are new individuals coming into the population, sometimes there aren't. Now, there's not very many starfish in the world that can do this. I think there's about 17 species. And in New Zealand we have three of those, so it's very interesting that we have so many in a relatively small area or a country with a relatively short latitudinal distribution. At the moment we only find this, the, the, this, one of these species that I'm particularly interested in, Alistair Castor polyplex, in Otago Harbour, although it's reported to occur throughout New Zealand. So I would be very interested if people are finding the starfish in other places and learning exactly where they, where they do occur. Um, it's uh, normally found under rocks. It doesn't like being out in the open. It doesn't like the sunlight, so you need to turn rocks over to find this starfish. And it normally is found towards the bottom of the shore. When the tide is quite low, you'll find it. The common name of the starfish is the four and four starfish because it generally has eight arms four of which will be original arms and four arms which will be quite new, arms that it's regrowing. And, and it's generally this grey colour, sometimes almost blue, and it can be mottled. This specimen has uh, got grey patterning on it, or darker patterning on it, but it's got some white blotches as well, so colour can be a bit variable. There are two other species of starfish in New Zealand which do the same thing, which have this unusual mode of reproduction where they divide in half. Its scientific name is Alistair Castor insignis, and it has got, it's a, the three and three starfish, so it has three longer arms and three slightly shorter ones here, so it reproduces the same way, it divides in half and then grows the three missing arms. Uh, in this case the starfish is, is, is orange in colour. Again, it is quite sensitive to light, but they also occur out in the open a bit more than uh, the four and four starfish do. And finally, there's a, a third species of dividing starfish in New Zealand called Coscomysterius muricata. Now, this is very widely distributed. We know this occurs almost everywhere in New Zealand on the east and west coast and in the intertidal uh, and down to subtidal. It has a very variable arm number. There can be as few as seven or eight. Uh, often nine, but very commonly 11, but maybe as many as 13.